Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. A conviction for terroristic conduct should result in as many as five years behind bars and up to $5,000 in fines. But two male students got off lucky. 18-year-old Harris Joe Stephen had wrote a bomb threat, and although he admitted to not having the courage to leave it, his teacher discovered the note which stated a bomb would go off in the school's 1,000 building. As outlined in his deferred plea, Stephen won't be sentenced to jail time, but instead is ordered to finish school and complete 100 hours of community service, half of which must be done at Southern High School. A similar deferred agreement was accepted for 19-year-old Roger Dean Barcinilla. He's responsible for writing a bomb threat in the boys' bathroom at J.P. Torres Alternative School. When interviewed by police, he said it was only a joke. As outlined in his deferred plea, he must finish his high school education in addition to 416 hours of community service. His deal also orders he write apology letters to a school principal the Guam Fire Department, and the Guam Police Department. If after three years both students have complied with the terms of their deals, both will have their records wiped clean. If either is expelled from school or convicted of any crime, then the deferred status of their plea agreements will be revoked. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Crystal Paco. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.